Hello, Harlequin here, just doing another video. Um, this is like a 1.5, uh, it's like the episode 1.5, because it's in between 1 and 2. It wasn't recorded then, but it's more of a discussion than an actual full um, episode. And also, it doesn't fit the criteria, because I don't get a 2.0. But it's something I want to talk about, and it's a kind of a lesson that I've learned. Um, so basically, where I want to start is mute my computer if I can open the mixer. Yeah, that one. Okay, basically, my computer's acting like an idiot and I can't mute anything. The bottom bar has gone like Windows 97 and it's really annoying me. So, yeah, I'll have to sort that out after. Oh, it's finally opened. Okay, now all my sounds are muted. So I can hear and think. So, it's an episode 1.5 type thing. Um, the discussion of this video is don't get caught up in kills, even in free for all until death match, because you'll make a stupid mistake. Also, one thing that I've noticed that's really annoying, especially in this match, people can't get killed by their own equipment. Like that guy didn't get killed by his own bouncing better, which is a bit daft, but yeah. So, I like, in this game, I feel I did relatively well. When I look back, I feel I didn't, because I made a massive mistake. I didn't pay attention to the scoreboard and I didn't pay attention to my surroundings. I kept running back to the same spot and it's really stupid of me because basically I kept running back to this spot and I fell off there. This is the only thing about this map, you seem to just fall off way too easily. So it just feels like I kept going back to the same spot and making stupid, stupid mistakes. like. I, I think this is the only spot and the one near the like stealth bomber thing that's on the side of the ship just behind me where I've just spawned. Um, I just feel like I only got kills there and if I spawned anywhere else I'd just run back to this spot and get killed on the way. This is a very good spot for playing free for all. Not really team deathmatch because your team will spawn around and then you miles away but... Um, I don't feel like this map is it's probably my least favourite map. I wouldn't say I don't like it, but it's just, I don't seem to do as well as I do on other maps. I've got good gameplays on it, don't get me wrong, but I just don't feel like I do as well, even if I do. Like, I know I'm, I'd say quote-unquote camping, but it's just, you can't really run around on this map. You've got to, like, patrol an area, and that's what I like to do on most maps when playing free-for-all, especially going for a higher KTD. Unless it's cargo, and I'll talk about that in my next um, actual full episode. Also, this is an episode 1.5 because I do know this will have bad, um, bad video. It won't look professional still, but I'm actually changing what I edit with the software. So I'm gonna sort that out, and hopefully it'll be a lot better. Because I'm gonna just use the same settings and see if it works on that instead of something else. Um, yeah, so going back to the point, you see I died back at the other spawn twice, and I didn't really like there, I got distracted as well, that's one other problem. You get distracted, especially using the engineer, he's probably the best third perk in the game, easily, because it just helps you so much, and you get like 50 points per, um, um, equipment you destroy or hack if you're using a black hat, which is amazing. So that's like two of that and you get killed. And a lot of people throw Betty's next to shock charges, so you're either going to destroy them both or hack them both, and then the Betty you can probably get killed with if you hack it. And I've done that quite a lot, and it, it just helps, really helps a lot. But anyway, get distracted. But yeah, so I feel like I didn't watch the scoreboard and I actually thought I was winning, but I. I, in my defence, this was a really late night game, like 1 morning or something like that, 1 or 12, something like that. And um, I weren't on the best disconnections. This match went too bad, the other games I did play weren't really good connection. And I feel like I didn't really... I know this, the aim of this series is to learn from our mistakes, and I suppose I am learning from this mistake. And it, but it's a hard thing to do, it's hard to pay attention to the scoreboard in free for all because you're really intent on killing people and you're nearly always in the action. Also the only problem about this um, this spot is if you kill somebody, run back to the centre bit. 
So like I'll tell you when, like here, where I'm just standing. Always run back to here or at least past it. Or someone will spawn there. So if you're patrolling this area, just walk back when you kill somebody or someone will probably spawn there. And it's happened to me the game before this, when I got on this map. Because I was running round and I was using oh, I think I was using a tar. I can't remember, it was one of the assault rifles. And I just didn't seem to do very well because on this map you can't really run around in free throw because the spawns are hectic. There's not you have to really patrol your areas. That guy got home. <laughs> I did quite proud of that kill. Yeah, certain kills you get you are quite proud of. But see I'm winning here by three and I just get it in my head that oh I'm winning. Like I won't pay attention much, but I, I always thought I was winning for the whole game. And I'm like, I get it in like in my head and I keep making mistakes like that and I've just got to learn from them especially if I'm going to try and get 2.0 okay to the overall I think at the moment it's somewhere 1.49 1.48 maybe lower I don't know it's just meh. it just doesn't seem to be I seem to be making dap mistakes like this but I will learn from them and hopefully become a better card player especially on free for all I really enjoy free for all on this game Never enjoyed it that much. I think on COD 4 I liked it, but that's where about it. But yeah, learning from mistakes. I might do another episode, like, after my next one I might do a 2.5 if I um, figure out something else I want to talk about. But this was just mainly about painting the piece around and stuff like that. Like there. I could easily got killed shooting at a sentry gun with an unsilenced weapon in the middle of the map. Not smart. Not smart at all. I know I did destroy it, and yeah. But I lost. Which was I wasn't too pleased about, and I could if I killed that guy and that I would have got a two point zero, but meh, it wasn't really impressive game. So that's it. I'll see you in my next episode. Do it.